I'm here to fuck up the game, gon' get it I'm feeling myself, fresh to death, bitch, I'm killing myself, I'm gone We burning it up, step in the building, we turning it up Talking that shit, but they never admit when I said to them like I be murdering it, and we living Yo, yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Fat Dallas Bringing you some more Madden 17 gameplay in the background as we talk about Madden 18 and a few keys to help you dominate as soon as the game is released, man. You don't have to wait until a month and a half or two months down the road after release to go on Twitch and find all these YouTubers and, and uh, competitive people screaming. You can come out winning right away, man. Also, I want y'all to hit that thumbs up button. We got 40 likes on the last video, about 45 likes. So I will be bringing y'all my defensive scheme. Shout out to all y'all that's been rocking with your boy for a while, man. Let me know in the comment section your name so I can start giving shout outs on videos. And also, before we go any further, we got a giveaway coming up the first week of August. So, y'all let me know in the comment section right now. Be active in the comment section for your boy. Do y'all want $25? Each console, that means 25 PlayStation and 25 Xbox, two winners, or do y'all want 50 big buckaroos, one winner takes all. All you got to do is like this video right now and retweet or share, Facebook or Twitter, either one. Let your boy know, man. Uh, more and more videos coming out. I will see who more and more active on the videos. I will see y'all name down in the comment section, and it'll make it easier for me to pick a winner. But... Let's get to Madden 18 keys. The number one thing that you need to do is have patience when the game come out. Don't run and jump online. It's a lot of new concepts supposed to be in the game. We don't really know how the run game is, so that's the reason why you need to hit skill trainer. You need to hit practice mode. You need to hit me up for lab sessions. Hit up another subscriber for lab sessions or a buddy with two controllers. All that type of stuff, man. You don't know what's really in the game. They say the game has changed, but they taking a long time to give us real gameplay. So I'm thinking the game is going to be about 90% the same as Madden 17 with a few tweaks here and a few tweaks there. Now they say you can't hold ball hop. So that's something that y'all should be able to get more familiar with in Madden 17. Pick up the sticks once or twice a week for about 45 minutes and just take... Uh, assist off and ball hawk and all that type of stuff and that'll help you get you uh used to running not running around holding the y button which i don't know why people was doing that in the first place now another thing that you need to do is go through four or five different playbooks even get ready for it right now in madden just go into uh online rank match or unranked or whatever you want to do and go into four or five different playbooks because from the videos that i did see on madden 18 it don't look like they changed the playbooks too much they added up a, a couple plays here a couple plays there they might took out some plays some cheese plays bunch weak might not be as op rams might not be as op but when you get the game Go through four or five different playbooks, man. I'm telling you, you can get you a scheme off of four or five different playbooks. See what works out of this playbook, what don't work out of this playbook on offense and defense. Because they say dime, quarters, all them type of defenses will not be able to shut down the run consistently. So if you got I-form and uh, ace, uh, double tight end type packages in your playbook, them might be the killer schemes this year, man. I haven't had my hand on the game. I'm not hearing too much info about it, but it might be the year where small packages, if the person don't know what he's doing on the defensive side, you might be able to dominate, man. And I'm going to let y'all know, as soon as I get my hand on the game, I think around the night of the 16th, I'll be able to start playing for the 10 hours, and then the pre-order, I'll be able to get it. So I'm going to be dropping schemes to y'all early. Uh, I might jump into career mode if that's something that y'all want to see, but Madden 18 Ways to Dominate. I know I'm going to be in the top of the leaderboards. I want to make sure that y'all are able to be on the top of the leaderboards also. So, have patience, practice, playbooks, different playbooks. Get you a scheme together. Come out only running small schemes for a whole practice session for about 45 minutes. Small schemes. Let's see. You do a counter to the left right here with a motion person before, right? Now, you do a counter. Now, you do a... Uh, play action pass with that same motion type setup but you put this guy in a streak and this guy in an out route about five yards do schemes like that to bait your opponent maybe the play action will be fixed the block shed will be fixed it won't be instant block sheds so these are all important keys this is fundamentals that a real life player will use 
you know, swerving, cross man, and all that type of stuff. All these YouTubers that was using that stuff last year and Madden 17 and getting the boost, and people were saying they the goat, they good, and all that type of stuff. That wasn't real life scheme. This might be the year where you can use real life scheme. So I'm telling you, go into practice mode, hit me up, lab sessions practice you a scheme get you a scheme together and don't go away from your scheme if it's third down and 12 and you got a block shed in a sack stick to your scheme stick to the stuff that you know that work and the stuff that you're comfortable with we're gonna have a longer series next time but let me know in the comment section about the giveaway and we'll continue this conversation it's all love let's get it